Today I'm gonna to walk you through making my favorite, which is a vegan Caesar. We are gonna start with our croutons, which are so easy to make. You can go ahead and use any bread you have. I just took a couple of actual hamburger buns here and cut them up into about half inch pieces. I'm gonna transfer all of those into a bowl. And you can season these with anything you like. I'm just gonna show you the basics. I'm using extra virgin olive oil and just over the top so it's coated. I'm gonna guess that's about a teaspoon and a half. You can see there. And then I'm gonna take about a teaspoon of salt. Salt's really gonna give it the flavor and it's gonna season your salad as well. So I just mix those with my hands. And you can see they're nicely coated. And I'm gonna put them in the oven at 400 for about 10 minutes. And while they're baking, we're gonna make our cashew Caesar dressing. So for the dressing, like I said before, it actually is a cashew base. This is one of my favorite bases for dressings because it tastes so delicious, so creamy, but is really good for you. So I'm gonna start with about a cup of cashews and put them into a high powered mixer or blender. It's important so that it gets completely pulverized. We're gonna go ahead and add water and I just cover the top of the cashews. That way we can decide on the thickness if we wanna add more or not. I'm gonna do fresh squeeze the lemon juice. I love these little squeezers. You put it right in over and so about the juice of half a lemon and then we're going to do salt i always do himalayan sea salt and it's about a teaspoon right in and one of my favorite things to do and add is capers and i'm going to do about a tablespoon of capers and a little of the reserved water and we're just going to take it and blend it I always start on low. Um, this is actually called a tamper in your blender and it's incredible because you can move and stir things around while it's blending. Go ahead and turn the blender on. <laughs> dressing here and whether you want it individually plated or do it in a bowl family style we have you covered so if I'm gonna do it um, I like cutting just right around and cutting it right in half because I think it gives it such a beautiful splash and I just go ahead and put it on here letting it kind of fall and then I would sprinkle some croutons over the top and then dressing and just drizzle it right over the top. And you wanna do about three spoonfuls for this head of lettuce. Or if you're going to a party, we're gonna go ahead and I take my lettuce right down the middle, slice it one more time. And then from this end, we can go ahead and chop just to get your pieces. And then we're just gonna do the exact same thing. We're gonna put it in the bowl, top it with croutons, and I go ahead and drizzle the dressing over it. And then we're gonna take some of the croutons. I just like putting them organically around. And then you can either do the dressing on the side or drizzle it right over. So you can go ahead, like I said, just make it individually for yourself or bring it to a party. This is absolutely one of my favorite recipes. I hope it becomes yours as well. Enjoy!